shalom. It's time to put on our thinking hats. It's time that we get off of the drug of choice, which has been the milk of God's word. It's time to have sustenance, food. It's time to have meat that we can chew on. Too long have we only had milk of the word. Who will come and feed the master's house who will meet while the master is away? Uh, and this is food, and it's time for food, it's time for meat. And this world, all of it, is apostate. None of the religions out resemble the beginnings of those religions. Much has been lost along the way. So welcome and love from love, hope from hope, and peace from peace. These are the days of much Bible prophecy coming to pass. And it saddens me there are, is no non-apostate people upon the face of the earth. I am the only one that has the right faith. And that right faith is that none of us are any damn good, but it's love in us that makes us good. And uh, Habakkuk 2 foretold the just will live by that faith. So these are the days of Elijah where I accuse all people of having a false god. A false god who is a respecter of men, loves them best. A god who is the lord of conditional love and which has never been divine. There is no such thing as conditional love. Conditional love's not loyal or faithful or dedicated at it all. And lastly, uh, you know that you have a, a outright uh, false god. If you don't have the God of the Bible, Jeremiah 32, 27, declaring, I am the Lord God of all mankind. And you know you got a false Christ if you don't have the Lord uh, Jesus Christ Almighty, who is the good shepherd over all the flocks of man. And I rest your, my case, you are all totally apostate.